What's up guys? It's your girl Simply Free with Simply Free Mom Life. Today guys, I bring to you a simple made lasagna. So let's talk and more work and let's get into it. Boil your lasagna noodles as directed on the box and add a little salt for taste if desired. Chop up some garlic as fine as you can get it. Chop up your onion fine. If you place your onions in the freezer, for a little while before chopping them, it will cut down it burning your eyes. Ground your beef and add your onions and garlic to it. Chop up some pepperoni. It's optional, but I always do it. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. But if you're returning, welcome back. If you haven't already, don't forget to like and subscribe. Drain your ground beef after it's done cooking. Add your pepperoni, your tomato sauce, your diced tomatoes, your garlic powder, onion powder, salt, and pepper, Italian season, and basil season. After draining the hot water off of your noodles, allow them to um, run in cold water and then lay them out flat in a pan or on a surface. Now let's stack this baby up. I'm gonna pour some regular sauce at the bottom. Shake it around so it can be evened out. Lay out your noodles, make sure they cover the whole bottom. Then you will put on your cheese. I use cottage cheese. Um, I tried it and I liked it. Normally I use um, ricotta cheese, but it's so thick and it's hard to spread sometimes. So cottage cheese for me, uh, my meat mixture, my shredded cheese, and then repeat until your pan is full. That's a cheese thief. She didn't know I was recording. <laughs> Thank you. 
right, so for the last layer, just put meat sauce on the top and sprinkle some cheese on it and add some parsley flakes if you want, that's optional. I use a different cheese for the top. Just a tip, if you fill your pan to the top like I do, be sure to place your pan into a bigger pan because it will drip as it bakes. A little parsley flakes never hurt nobody. So it went from this to this. There you have it guys. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. The recipe will be listed below. You guys be blessed. And don't forget to live simply.